Hi, my name is Miss Helen and today I'm going to introduce 3D shapes. 3D stands for three dimensional. They are basically solid shapes and not flat shapes. We're going to use words like faces, edges and vertices to describe these 3D shapes. A face, or sometimes known as a side, is the flat part of the shape. You can see here on the cube. An edge is the straight part of the shape, as you can see on the keyboard. A, vertice, a vertex or vertices are basically corners, which you can see on this pyramid. So when we're describing a cube, we would say it has six faces that are square shaped, it has four straight edges and eight vertices. So eight corners. The cuboid is very similar to the cube. However, it has rectangular faces. It still has six faces and 12 edges and eight vertices though. This shape is a cylinder. It has three faces, the circle on the top, the circle on the bottom, and the part that goes around. Even though it's curved, this is still a face. It has two edges. A straight part of the circle on the top and a straight part of the circle on the bottom. It doesn't have any vertices there. This is a sphere. People recognise it as like a football shape. It has one face. The whole of the surface is one face. However, it has no edges and no vertices. This is a pyramid, but it's a special type of pyramid. It's called a square base pyramid because it has a square on the bottom. It has five faces, or triangular faces, and one square face, and it has eight edges. It also has five vertices. This is a cone. People remember it by thinking of an ice cream cone. It has two faces, the circle on the bottom, and the smooth curved part of the basic cone. It has one edge, the circle at the bottom, and one vertex at the top. So I hope you've learned something from 3D shapes. Remember the new language that we have learned. So faces are the flat part of the shape, edges are the straight part of the shape, and the vertex or vertices are the corners. Thank you very much. Bye.